The Nazareth 1918 Capital Project uh, is a $7.5 million project to totally renovate inside and outside the old Nazareth YMCA building. And these three individuals are leading the charge to get that work done. For quite some time, I've been trying to find a way to give back to the community. And I started thinking about, you know, those many years that I spent at the Y, driving past the Y, and you kind of see here sits a 100-year-old building that in all honesty is in desperate need of repairs. When I knew this is what was important to me and what I wanted to follow through with, I had dinner with Bill Sandbrook and shared with Bill kind of what my thought was. Bill wholeheartedly jumped in and says, I'm willing to help. I wanted to get involved in the fundraising campaign because now this why, you know, it's a very historic building. I wanted to preserve the character for, for the street, but when you walk through it, you can see it needs a facelift. So I'm, I'm very happy to be able to participate. I support the YMCA because it, it's great for the Nazareth community and I believe in keeping my body physically fit and I want to spread that joy and that understanding to the community. When you think about the Y, it's been a long-standing institution of downtown Nazareth for over 100 years. It provides all kinds of services and activities for all ages, whether it's seniors, adults, children, and it provides a lot of value to the community. I've been affiliated with the YMCA since I moved to Nazareth in 1970 in eighth grade. It was very impactful on me in the rest of my life and I really wanted to support this project. We have to keep our bodies physically fit and mentally alert for a lifetime and this is a great place to do it. Everybody has stepped in, whether it's on the government level, whether it's on the local community. It deserves this project and I think everybody's going to be proud of what we've done and love using that Y for the next hundred years. The awardees this year are totally strengthening the mission of the YMCA and by their efforts of helping us increase this building's capacity, they'll be helping countless generations of children and seniors and people here in the Nazareth community that'll use this YMCA better uh, over the next hundred years. I'd really like to thank everybody that's kind of worked on the Nazareth YMCA campaign. Big thank you for everybody, really appreciate it. And again, we're gonna all be proud of what we've accomplished together. I thank David Fagerstrom and the Greater Valley Y to nominate me as one of the winners of the YMCA champion. I'd like to thank David and Ryan for really being the glue that's held this whole campaign together. It's a very, very impactful project so that we can all leave a legacy for the next hundred years of the Y's future.